is me Dina Amir and welcome to my channel. So for today, we're gonna learn about slang, killjoy. But before I begin for this video, I'm just gonna use informal pronunciation. For those of you who still not clear yet, what is informal pronunciation? Please watch my number 53 video which is about confusing pronunciation. So, killjoy is a person who deliberately spoils the enjoyment of others. So, our slang for today is potong steam. Potong steam. So, potong means cut. Steam is also steam in Malay, which is water vapor basically. So, if you say potong steam for killjoy, which basically means like it's you cutting off the steam of happiness. So before I elaborate further, I like to share also other slang. For example, naik steam. Naik steam. So naik is go up, steam is steam also, water vapor. So when you say naik steam, the steam is going up. So this is bahasa pasar as well, pijin. Same like potong steam. But this one is naik steam. So naik steam, there are two meanings. First one, naik syahwat. Naik syahwat. So, naik syahwat means arouse. Sexually arouse. Okay. And then the second one, naik darah. Naik darah means marah, angry. So, darah means blood. So, when you say naik steam, it's more common. The meaning is the first one, naik syahwat. Sexually arouse. Compared to the second meaning, naik darah. Naik darah, if people say naik steam for naik darah, that is not common compared to naik syahwat, okay? But of course, you don't say naik steam just like that. Otherwise, people might think you are a pervert and they will avoid you. Of course, you don't want that to happen, right? And plus, it's like not respecting people that much when you say like that to people who you are not supposed to say. So, about potong steam, the killjoy, I give example here. For example, Lala said to Lulu, Lulu, kita ada kelas tambahan hujung minggu ni. Lulu, kita ada kelas tambahan hujung minggu ni. Lulu, kita ada kelas tambahan hujung minggu ni. So, Lulu, we have extra class this weekend. So, how Lulu respond to this? Potong steam. Aku baru je plan nak pergi melancung. Potong steam. Aku baru je plan nak pergi melancung. So basically it means kill joy. I just plan to travel. So potong steam here not necessarily refer to someone, a person. Just like the meaning of kill joy. So potong steam, anything that shut you down from that happiness, then you say potong steam. For example, now, Lulu feels so potong steam. She already planned to go travel and she's happily looking forward for that moment. But then, suddenly Lala came and informed her that they have extra class. Of course, Lulu has to cancel the plan to travel. So, that is potong steam. Okay, let's take a look at the second example. For example, your friend say to you, Jom kita keluar. Teman aku pergi makan. Jom kita keluar. Teman aku pergi makan. Jom kita keluar. Teman aku pergi makan. So basically it means, let's go out. Accompany me to eat. Then you say, potong steam. Aku tengah tengok TV ni. Potong steam. Aku tengah tengok TV ni. So kill Joe, I'm watching TV right now. So your friend said to you, sekejap je. Sekejap je, just for short. Last one, example. For example, you laughing very hard. You so happy and you laugh very hard. And then suddenly your friend said to you, Jangan ketawa kuat sangat. Nanti malam ni tak boleh tidur. Jangan ketawa kuat sangat. Nanti malam ni tak boleh tidur. So for the superstitious belief, if you laughing too much, maybe you invited uninvited guests. Something like maybe ghosts or spirit, something like that. So, jangan ketawa kuat sangat. Nanti malam ni tak boleh tidur. So, it means don't laugh too loud. Later at night, you won't be able to sleep. Then, you respond to this potong steam. Potong steam. 
Well, I guess that's all the lesson for now. Thank you very much for watching me. And if you like my video, you may support me on Patreon. For those of you who's watching me right now, thank you very much. And till we meet again then. Bye.